Hey y'all and welcome back to class here at Move with Sable. I'm so glad that you're joining me for class here today because today I'm taking us through about a 20 minute lower body dumbbell blast workout. You need one set of dumbbells. I'm going to be using 25s. You choose a weight that will challenge you but let you finish each round strong. We're going to be working off the clock right here because as you know, me counting reps and talking at the same time doesn't usually work out. Here we go. I'm going to go over here and get set. Join me with your weights. And we're gonna rack one weight and step back into a reverse lunge with the other leg. I'm gonna grab my dumbbell, get set up and punch that clock. Are you ready to move with me? So we're racked and we're back. Driving off that back foot, bending nice and square through your front knee. One more. And you're going to move on to the other side. Here we go. Sit and make sure I'm not going to step on my other dumbbell. Take it back. It always takes me just a second to like find my strength and my balance when I move legs. Get yours. I knew I was going to do that. Here we go. That's better. One more. Perfect. Center up for me, rack that weight in the middle like a little goblet, and we're going to squat. Down and up. So knees track out over your toes. Chest stays lifted. And keep that tailbone from curling under in the bottom, okay? Hinge. Drive up through all four points of your feet in your squats. That's it. And we're gonna take a 30 second rest, okay? So we have three rounds of exercises, four sets each with that 30 seconds rest in between. We're gonna go ahead and turn. We're gonna gear up to start with that reverse lunge on the left leg again for the second set. Roll those shoulders up, down and back. I don't know which way to turn. <laughs> Let's grab that weight. Here we go, three. Two, and one, step it back. I think, I think it would be like this. There we go, so now you can see my body. There we go. Perfect. So that weight is nice and tight. You could even bring it into your chest a little bit like this. One more here. All righty, other side. So that weight is racked up on your working side. Right, and back. So I actually like this position with it tucked into my chest a little bit better. I feel stronger, more balanced. So play around with your weight positions here. Do what works for you at home. One more. Perfect. Sit up on the middle for those squats. Okay? Rack it up. Down and up. Now it's totally normal for your breath to come up on this. Let me turn. I want you to see my hinge. Good. Take one more for me. Perfect. All right, you get to rest. Check it out. You're halfway through the first round. I'm gonna grab a drink of water. What is your drink of choice during workouts? I hope it's water or something of the sort, you know, but some people drink BCAAs during a workout. 
I don't like flavor. What do you like at home? Water? Flavor? Let me know in the comments. Let's chat. Here we go. Again. Round three, 30 seconds. Rack that lunge, babies. Nice and strong. So your other arm. You know, whatever you want to do with it. Hand on hip. I tend to take it out. Like I've got an imaginary support. One more. All right, cooking with gas. Other side. Taking that weight in, stepping back. Are you square? Are you staying strong right here through your core? One more. Yep. Whoo. All right, squats in the middle. Take it down. So I'm here working with you. I'm breathing hard too. Don't be afraid to let it out right here. Drive up, heels and toes. Two more. Last one. Push it out strong. Good, park that weight. 30 second rest right here. Whew. So because we're in racked positions with these weights, your torso is getting a little bit of extra work too. That's how I like to do these home workouts. Get the most for your money, the most for your time, especially if we're doing 20 minutes or less. This is round four coming at you. Setting it up. Here we go. Step and lift. Everybody strong. We probably got two more. What did you think? Two? One more? There we are. Awesome. Let's take it on the other side. Set it up. Really strong through that front leg. Really strong everywhere. Just channel all that strength. Are you a powerhouse right here or what? Come on. A little tip, the answer is not or what. Two. One, beautiful, bring it up in the front. Let's get those squats ready, right here. Ha. We're moving. This is four of these, you don't have to do squats again. What have I told you that? No squats again. Here we go from the side, check it out. Up. Everybody's depth is gonna be a little bit different. Don't worry about it. Do you have two more? Two. We got it. Last one. Oh, I pushed you a little bit past 30, but we ain't gonna die, right? Let's take 30 seconds rest. I'm gonna twist on my back just a little bit. And we're moving on to round two. Let me show you what that looks like. So we're gonna start with a balance pull. We're gonna hold our weights in tight, pulling the knee up right here. 30 seconds each side, all right? 30 seconds each side. Then, again with that weight racked, we'll take in and out squats. Are you ready? Here we go, grab your weight. Start with that right leg forward, 30 seconds. On the clock, so we're pulling up, straight back. Pulling up, 
straight back. If you need to tap, that's what we're gonna be here, tap. And because I just have a 25, I think I am gonna hang out on this tap. You know, you just have to feel it sometimes, feel what works for you. One more. Beautiful, other side. Sink it in low, tap, and back. Focus in on that balance. All your weight is in your left heel. So much heat. So much heat in that leg. One more. Awesome. I'm just gonna change how I'm holding my weight for these in and out squats. I like it like this. Down and lift. Holding it tight to my chest, to my bad body. To my bad body. That was an accident, I swear I didn't mean it. One more. Awesome. Ooh, 30 seconds, we need you. Cause that was just one. That was just one. Check it out. This is a trick. This is cardio and weights. Do you know what that is? That's metabolic conditioning. That's what drives that metabolism up. That's what torches calories. That's what gets you the shape that you want. So if you're getting tired right here and you're like, oh my gosh, we're only one in. Stay with me. Know what you're working for. Here we go. We are gonna alternate this time though, instead of left and right, let's alternate this bad boy. Let's do that. So here's one. Here's one. Keep it low. Tight. You gotta pull in that belly button to protect that low back here. Finding my mark every time here. That's it. Oh, was that money or what? 30 seconds in and out squats. Hit it. All right, guys. We're in it, doing it right here. This is the middle of your workout. The middle is where it gets messy. Are you here for the messy? Go ahead and hit that like button. Let me know if you're here for the messy. Awesome, that's it, rest, rest. We gotta do that two more times, okay? We're gonna take it back to one leg at a time though for that balance pull. Yes, we are. I like, I'm gonna start on this side this time. Change my view. When you're working out at home, sometimes you just have to change your view, find that space that works best for you. Here we go. On that left leg, that is my left, that is my left, left leg forward. Here we go. Tap and back. So if you notice this time, I'm also changing my grip on my weight. And we're gonna take one more. Yes, we are. Don't stop here. That's where you stop. Other side. Right leg is forward. Tapping that left. Drive it back straight. You hear? We got hair now. <laughs> Now we're three rounds or three sets into the second round. It's normal to slow down. One more. Yes. 
in and out, squats. Check it out. If you need to set your weight down, do that. Make your workout work for you guys, gals. We're gonna take two more. This is it. Perfect. Let's take that big 30 second break right here. I'm gonna grab water. Look, I've got sweat coming off my elbows. You do not need a whole lot of equipment to get a great workout at home. You just need a little know-how. Stay with me here and we'll get it done. One more set of this. Thank goodness. I'm ready to move on from this one. All right. I'm gonna change my grip again. Me changing things in the middle of the workout is a, is a tip that I'm really not enjoying this. So you know, if that comforts you, enjoy it. So I'm gonna here and tap, here and tap. I kinda like this though. It's driving my focus down back onto that right leg. That's where I want it to be. Okay, we're gonna make it. Guys, we're gonna make it. That's it, other side. Now I'm stoked for this because I, I finally feel, finally feel like it's where it's meant to be. Get that chest up, get those abs in. We're gonna boss this to the end, we got it. One more. Sweet, I like that. All right, that was money. Here we go, one more time on these in and out squats. Over and up. Yeah, this is it, come on. What you got? Stand up tall every time. Two, yes, one more. All righty, deal. 30 second break, you got one more round. And then you get to put this workout to bed. Should have brought a towel for this one. All right, breathe. Get those doubts and fears out of your mind. Tell them to shut up. We got one more, okay? And we're gonna take a side lunge to a forward lunge. I'm gonna turn to the side on this one. I'm gonna show you with no weight first because we're gonna do 30 seconds each leg. So you're gonna step it over with your weight and then forward with your weight. That's over with your weight, forward with your weight, okay? And then I'll turn around and we'll do it the other way. You're welcome, that was a little bit more than 30 seconds. Here we go, ready? Team, let's go. Over with your weight, forward with your weight. Go nice and slow. Find your foot every time. Take it over. One more time, take it up. All right, we're gonna reset on the other side. Here we go. Moving my timer. Over with your weight. And forward with your weight. Lift the chest, lift that power. You got this. He 
You don't have to worry about going fast. You're working those big muscle groups here. Last time up, 30 second rest. What I was saying, you don't have to worry about fast. You're working these big muscles right here. It's gonna work your heart rate. You're gonna be pulling those lungs. Number two. You got about 10 more seconds. Let me turn and face you this time around. Okay, three, two, and here we go. I'm stepping this way. Whichever way you step, just make sure you do the other leg next. <laughs> you don't end up lopsided, looking like Popeye with one of your legs. Solid right here. Yeah, we got it. Keep it moving. Last one. Forwards again. All right. Other side. Over. And up. Good. So this is probably my favorite round, not just because it's the last one, but because I like this multi-directional movement challenge. It's making my brain stay anchored right here, focus on what I'm doing. So I just have to work through it. One more. Beautiful. 30 second rest. That's two, two more. All right, I'm wearing cross trainers for these. Something that's grippy, not too soft, so I've got a good base of support through the floor. I don't recommend a running shoe or sneaker for this. Make sure you are wearing the right shoes or you're barefoot. Let's turn to the side for this one. Here we go. Three, two, and one round three. Here's our money makers. Let's get them. Right here push power from your core over and in brilliant let's turn it around make it work for you Time forward. Awesome. 30 second break. All right, guys, we got one more round. It's us. We're going to finish this together. There was something else I was going to say. Ah, this is all lower body. It's a little bit of cardio. So if you're here with me today, doing this lower body, doing this cardio, come back tomorrow, hit that upper body, hit those abs. There's a little something for every day here. Which how did I start with last time? Mm, we'll just go. We'll just face the front. We'll get it. Let's just face front. Are we ready? Here we go. Over. And up. Big breaths in. I want you to make this last round the best one yet. There's nothing else after this. Except maybe a good stretch. That's it right there. May I recommend my gentle stretch or low back relief? That'd be a nice 10 minute way to really round out your day with this. My dog agrees. Oh, 
Oh yes, the end is in sight. We were gonna go one more. One more for all the money. All right. Peace out, dumbbell. All right, guys. That was it. We made it. I feel really good, really strong. I hope you do too. Make sure that you are subscribed so you can join me right here for more sweat, more strength, more often.